The next uh, number we'd like to try is one that's uh, been asked for here tonight, and it's one that's been done many different ways. The first version I ever heard of this tune was, uh, if you folks remember Clarence Ashley that was out here, uh, well, I figured you would. We know Clarence by the name of Tom Ashley. He's been a friend of ours for 15 years. He's from Shawns, Tennessee. And uh, this number, as far as I've ever been able to find out, originated right around Shounds, uh, written by a blind fiddler. Now, you might have heard Tom mention this fella, uh, boy by the name of G.B. <coughs> Grayson. He was a blind fiddler, and he recorded back in the early or late, early and late 30s. And he was killed in 1938 or 9, I believe, hanging on the side of a truck and uh, they run a little small dirt road down there in East Tennessee. And there was a cliff, rock cliff, on the side of the road, and he was dragged off by this cliff and killed. He had a partner by the name of uh, Henry Whittier from Galax, Virginia, and they did Handsome Molly, Train 45, and a lot of them old numbers. Some of you may be familiar with them. In fact, you might have the records. But anyhow, as far as I've ever been able to find out, this is where... Uh, train 45 come from. Now we recorded it once. No, I'll try to sing a little of it. They wanted, to, they wanted me to sing it. Yeah, we used to play it in the East, you remember that. Right? It's been a long time. <laughs> Anyhow, I want to try it because I promised some boy over there a while ago I'd try it. And of course we recorded it a little different and uh, I understand lately that it's been uh, recorded also on a different version or two. But as far as I've been able to find out, this is the original version of Train 45. Could we play it this time? Kind of Thank 
Thank you folks very much. Saturday night 